Hi guys, welcome to Shields Cooking. Today we're going to prepare one of the most important basic sauces in the kitchen. And I'm talking about choux de veau. It takes some time, but trust me, it's totally worth it. So, let's begin. Start by putting two kilos of veal bones on an oven tray and also add one kilo of veal till. Now toast this at 200 degrees Celsius for 45 minutes. Meanwhile, clean three big onions and chop them in thick slices. Then heat up a big baking pan, add a splash of oil and caramelize the onions on a medium heat. While that's caramelizing, cut one leek in half and clean it. Now chop it. Also clean and chop one celery, two carrots, half a celeriac, and two bulbs of garlic. Once the onions are caramelized, add 150 grams of tomato paste and 500 grams of peeled tomatoes. Bake this for an additional 5 minutes. Then add half a liter of red wine and reduce this. Now transfer the toasted bones into a big pan. Then deglaze the oven tray with 300 milliliters of red wine. Put the tray back into the oven for 10 minutes and then pour the liquid into the pan. Now submerge the bones completely with cold water and then bring it to a boil. Once it's boiling, turn down the heat and remove any fat and foam using a ladle. Now add the tomato mixture together with the cut vegetables, the garlic, 10 sprigs of thyme, 4 leaves of bay leaf and 20 pepper grains. Let this simmer for 20 hours. Then drain it and let it drip for half an hour so you don't waste any sauce. After that, put it through a fine sieve. Now bring it to a boil and reduce it till two thirds. Meanwhile, remove any fat using a ladle. Now put it through a sieve once more and then it's ready to be used. You can use it for many different things. Here I reduce it just a little bit more, season it with a balsamic vinegar and use it as a glaze for some delicious braised short ribs. Okay guys, that's it for today. I hope you've enjoyed the video. So don't forget to like and share it and subscribe if you want to see more. Bon appétit!